Hello guys, welcome, welcome back to my channel. Nino here again. I'm going to be doing a collective reading for you guys. I know I've been a little bit MIA. I've just been really busy with a lot of things, doing readings and all that, but I'm going to be continue to be more consistent, guys. So also, Merry Christmas Eve, guys. Hope you guys are doing well. Hope you guys are, you know, spending time with family or however you do your Christmases. Hope you guys are just enjoying your time, okay? So the channel message I kept getting was you are stronger than you think, okay? So I'm getting something about this holiday season. For some of you, this holiday season could be testing you or maybe you were tested for some time and I feel like now this year is coming to an end. Now things are going to start to close out for you guys, okay? So I definitely feel like for some of you, you guys could be in the blues about something or this could be like Christmas blues or maybe the holiday season could be a little bit um, sad for some of you or there's a little bit of sadness I'm picking up on with somebody. For others of you, I feel like you're spending time with your family and you're trying to enjoy the holidays, okay? But I'm also hearing missing you as well. So somebody could be missing you or you're missing someone for the holidays. Okay, so maybe for some of you, you may not have went to go see your family this Christmas. All right. I'm hearing come home or I can't wait till you come home. For some of you, you may even come, you may go somewhere after Christmas. I know that may sound where you may have goals to travel to see somebody after the holiday, after Christmas is over. You may come home or you may go see someone after okay i don't want to keep hearing after or after after hours okay you guys could be going to the gym a lot too like late nine gyms i don't know if they're open right now but i'm seeing like gym as well okay or someone's name could be jim or jimmy i also heard gerardo okay so let's see the overall energies for you guys for let's just see whatever comes through okay I'm also seeing like a red dress or a blue dress. Okay, blues could be significant. I'm also seeing like earrings. Golden earrings or like rings. You could be getting a ring this Christmas. All right. Heart sentiment as well. Okay, so let's get started. What is coming in for the collective? Whatever comes out. Okay, we got someone is leaving your life. Yeah. Yeah, I'm getting you. Yeah, someone is empty. So I'm getting there may be someone that may like you may be missing someone or I'm getting someone could be away from the holidays or they're away from home for the holidays. Share it empty. OK, yeah, I'm also getting to Christmas is not the same without this person or without whatever this is. Something could be missing. OK, but I'm getting again. You are stronger than you think, though. All right. We're going to clarify that. Some of you guys could be getting a new chair or maybe there's like a, a family get together that you always have. But it's like now either one person is not here anymore or the, the one seat is empty or something about that. That's also what I keep channeling here with chair empty. OK, so let's see what else is coming in for you guys. But in generally, I do feel like someone is leaving your guys's life going into the new year. I do see you cutting things out and meeting uh, new people and cutting out old things. OK. And then let's see what we have next. Announcement. Wow. Yeah, so I'm getting you may you hear about this or there's an announcement that comes in about this this situation leaving. Okay, I'm also getting something about like airplane tickets or like flights, flight delays or something about you booking a flight. Okay, or it's like you book a flight after the holidays to go see someone or to go to a certain place. That may sound weird, but I don't want to keep getting that. Like you going to a place after the holidays or you going to see someone after the holidays. Or this could be vice versa. All right, but that's what I'm getting here with this bell energy. And then we have success. Wow. So I also feel like, too, there's a lot of going on for you as well. Someone could be a Sagittarius, but I feel like whatever this announcement is, I feel like it's going to bring you like a lot of happiness, a lot of success coming in as well. I keep hearing a bittersweet energy where it's like you're kind of in this energy where something is leaving your life or you're missing someone. But at the same time, um, there's like success coming in for you. OK, I also heard December 31st or December 29th or 28th could be significant. All right. Yeah, but I'm getting something about like it's a good time to go somewhere after the holidays. So book it after or book it like after the, the things are over, okay? I see a lot of stars energy as well, okay? But I do see an announcement for others of you that are launching something. I feel like you guys could be launching like a, a home business or a skincare product or something that you do that you're gonna be announcing after the holidays or you maybe have announced this recently, all right? 
and I feel like it's very successful or it's some type of success here, but we're going to clarify. But I keep hearing, yes, the Ace of Wands, I can't make this up. Success. Okay. I'm also getting, again, you are stronger than you think you are. A lot of you guys could also be, like, getting, working out your gym body. Or I'm getting something about your weight. Some of you guys could start seeing results of your body or your your um, your um physique, okay? I'm getting some of you have been really achieving this goal of wanting to look a certain way or wanting to be, like, thinner. I'm getting you're going to get that opportunity, okay? I'm also seeing somebody lifting weights. But I do see a lot of opportunity for success here, okay? So what if someone is leaving your life? Okay, somebody is leaving your life. The Seven of Swords. Oh, Lord. Let's see. Let me pull again. The Five of Cups. But it's in a reversal. Okay, so I feel like... Okay, so I'm getting you were, could have been sad about someone, and I'm getting you're getting over it. So some of you guys could have recently went through a breakup as well. Or some type of separation, but I feel like you're you're getting over that, or you will be going through that grieving process. Yeah, the blues energy. I'm getting like the Christmas blues, okay. But I'm getting you're you're kind of learning to accept it, or you're learning to move on. Yeah, the three of swords. Yeah, somebody's in the blues, or the blues about you. All right. But I'm getting you have to let this person go so that you can achieve success. I feel like once someone leaves your life, it's like all this blessings come in that's kind of what i'm thinking or once whatever this is leaves your life i feel like you're going to get some type of news or this is like almost like whatever this last parting is it's gonna like it's like all of a sudden these new opportunities come in for you where it's like it's just a lot of beautiful energy yeah the seven of swords like i said okay someone is leaving your life so this could be an air sign but i'm getting like yeah i'm getting deception i'm getting your you're walking away from this. So I'm getting a breakup. So some of you guys could have recently went through a breakup. Or you're finally letting go of someone that you knew was deceptive. But I feel like in some way you still felt connected to this person. Okay, for others of you, again, this could be you finding something out. And you cutting this person off. Okay, so I do see some trickery here. But I'm getting you or you don't know how strong you were to do this. You don't know how strong you were to let this person go. Let this situation go for you. Okay. I feel like it's a lot of um a lot of self-reflection here as well. But I'm getting you're getting through this. And it's like once this person leaves, it's like all these things come into you. So you could have cut somebody off again who was very toxic. I'm getting someone could have also stolen or somebody could have like did something that was like not not cool at all okay an announcement we got the nine of cups all right or they were stealing your time stealing your energy we have the nine of cups with the bell card so i do see some type of an announcement some type of like recognition all right i'm getting some type of good news coming in for you okay i also do see a lot of cups some of you guys could be gift getting cups or you guys could be ordering cups so i do see a lot of a lot of drinking a lot of celebration as well but yeah, that's what I'm getting here with the Two of Cups. Wow. So you know what I'm also getting too? You guys, a lot of you guys have new love coming in. And I've been saying this for you guys for a long time. But I do see some type of connection as well. This could even be, like I said, a business partnership or a friendship that you meet with somebody. Okay? I'm getting too. You also could be announcing that you're going to be traveling. Or you may hear someone wants to travel to you. Okay? I know I'm also hearing Taco Bell. Some of you guys could be eating Taco Bell. You guys are eating a lot of tacos as well, or like tamales, or like uh, for the holidays as well, I'm seeing, okay? I'm also seeing something about cinnamon here as well. So you guys could be using a lot of cinnamon, all right, or you're making a lot of things. But the Nine of Cups and the Two of Cups, I see some type of, like, okay, y'all. This is what I'm getting, basically, collective. Whatever that is going to leave your life or that is leaving your life, Yes, you have been sad about it, but I feel like it had to end so that this new announcement could come in, this new beginning. And again, the Two of Cups and the Nine of Cups. I do feel like, too, somebody may even feel like you're talking to somebody or they may feel like you have options. But with the Nine of Cups and the Two of Cups, I do see some type of relationship. And I'm seeing an engagement ring. Somebody could be getting engaged soon. Or you could be announcing a marriage, announcing a union. All right, so some of you may hear that somebody gets married or somebody... Uh, ties the knot so to speak also what i'm seeing i'm also getting a child here a baby 
all right or this could be like um cons like a surrogate as well this could even be a same sex couple with the two of cups but i see some type of like yeah success here some type of celebration some type of collaboration as well for you guys okay beautiful 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 energy so i'm getting the old has to go so that new can come in and we got the wheel of fortune you don't guys you don't know how blessed you are going to about to be for this, a lot of you guys that are in the blues i'm getting you're not going to be in the blues very long if you're missing somebody you feel like something is missing spirit is going to align you with whatever this is here with the wheel of fortune and the ace of wands it's part of your plan it's almost like you don't have to work hard to get whatever this is that's coming in. It's going to be given to you. Okay, this could be love. This could be a partnership. This could be self-love. Okay, also we see something about like the mirrors. I'm getting something about like those double mirrors as well. Some of you guys could be looking at your reflection or you're looking at... Like I'm getting you look different or there's something about you that looks different or something about you that feels different. Okay. Or you're going to start to feel different, okay? And I feel like you're going to see yourself differently with this two of cups. I don't know I'm seeing a mirror. Like a double double mirror or like a, a reflection here. But I'm getting it's like you're looking at yourself differently. Or you're you're seeing yourself differently. And this is also what's attracting like this love to you. This true love. Like this beautiful love, okay? Somebody could also have French ancestry. Alright, also heard brown hair. I also heard like um, Chile or like Ecuador. Someone could be South American as well. I know I heard the names Irma or Maria. All right, or Mary or the initials M could be significant. All right, that's just what I heard right now. Very interesting. But I feel like this announcement is going to be very good for you. And I feel like whatever this shit was in the past that you had to let go of that was deceptive. Bro, you don't see the blessing that is coming in for you. You do not see... The blessing that is coming in for you guys. Okay? And somebody's going to regret and they're going to feel left out in the cold here with the Five of Pentacles. Like, it could also be snowing where you are. Alright? I'm also getting something about, like, an, a home here. Like, a home improvement plan. Alright? I'm getting, you get you could be getting approved for, like, a home or, like, a... Um, this could even be, like, Section 8. I don't know why I heard that for some of you. But I'm getting something about a move or I'm getting to like whatever this this person this deceptive energy did. It's going to be it's going to it's going to come back to somebody and they're going to start to feel it. OK, and we have the six of wands. So I do feel like regardless, again, you're moving towards look at this, bro. You got the wheel of fortune, the six of wands and the ace of wands. Success, success and victory coming to you. OK. For others of you that are like musicians, artists, you guys could be dropping something or you guys could be dropping your artwork or dropping your portfolio. I'm seeing someone may also want to collaborate with you if you do like also like uh, designing certain things. I feel like somebody wants to collaborate, somebody wants to make an announcement. You may even receive this announcement through like an email. I'm hearing check your emails as well. All right. Or like a new job or a new opportunity. But with the six of wands and the ace of wands, I just see success victory here and i feel like going into january for you and going into the new year it's going to be very good for you okay but i feel like in order to get this someone has to go somebody has to leave so that this can come in and guess what baby you're gonna get it you're gonna get all this blessings that you've always wanted. It may, and it, you know, it may seem like it's too good to be true, but I feel like something's gonna come and it's gonna blow you guys away. And then you're gonna look back at the reading and you're like, "Wow, you were right. Like this did happen." So look out for that. Queen of Wands. Keep focusing on yourself. Keep taking care of yourself. Keep on. Um, I'm seeing somebody going to the hair salon. Like you, you're kind of under like a. Uh, like the hair dryer, like you're getting your hair done, okay, you're taking care of yourself, and you're looking beautiful, so I feel like this is going to be a very good energy for you, and then we got the king of cups, yep, love here as well, or this is you loving yourself more, you pouring into yourself with the king of cups, um, but that's what I see here for you guys, again, the queen of wands, yep, so that's what I have for you guys. Um, that was a very quick reading. And I hope you guys have a very beautiful, beautiful rest of your Christmas, guys. And look at that. The King of Wands.
definitely a counterpart energy or somebody that could also be matching your energy, matching your vibration coming in. All right. So, yeah, guys, that is for my reading. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.